Okay, so getting this started. Once again, I want to kind of take a look at one more tree diagram question. And I'll leave you guys the rest of the time to finish up your practice. We'll come back next week for reviewing quiz on Tuesday over S12 to 13. Probabilities is addition rule, multiplication rule, and then conditional probabilities as well. I'll work here on standard. Three. Okay, here's the situation. I want to outline this with the tree diagram. There are three companies, A, B, and C. Respectively, they produce 15, 40, and 45% of the major appliances sold in a certain area. I'm also given the defectiveness rates. 1% of company A appliances, 1.5% of B, and 2% of company C appliances need servicing within the first year of installation. Suppose a randomly selected appliance is defective. What's the chance it came from company A and then also company B? What are the two different events that this scenario is describing? Appliances. Appliance is produced by how many different companies? Three. So let's first outline those three different companies. I'm going to come over here. Get more space. Company A, B, and C. How many or what percent of appliances are produced by company A? Let's proportion this up into each of the three respective companies. What percent are produced by either? Company A would be 15%. B would be 40%. And C is 45%. Now I know what proportion fall into each of the respective companies. What other event is described in this situation? Yeah, whether they're defective or not. Whether they're broke or not broke. So let's put two more branches off of each of these three companies for whether their appliance broke and needs servicing or is working normally. So I'm going to put work service is working or it needs service. It's working or it needs service for each of the three companies. So really there are six different possible scenarios. I could have an appliance that's working or needs servicing from each of the three given companies. I have the defectiveness rates or the service rates from the three companies. It's 1% for company A, 1.5% for company B, oops, O1, and 2% for company C. Fill in the other three branches. What percent of company A appliances were working fine? 99. Each node in the tree should add up to 100%. 45, 40, and 15% for this node make 100%. 99 and 1% make 100% for this node on the tree. Let's see here. This would be 985. This is 98%. Okay, now that I've got the tree made, what do I do with all of these numbers? What percent of all the appliances were made from company A and working? What do I do with the 
and 99%. Fine. I want company A and working. I want two things to happen. So I need to multiply those two respective probabilities. Take 15% times 99%. We've got six different pairs of numbers to basically multiply together. 0.0015. Now for company B, I want company B and a working appliance, so that's 40% and 98.5%. Three, nine, four. And the remaining 40% and one and a half percent. Zero, zero, six. Zoom in. And then company C. I want to do from company C and working, so that's 98% times 45%. Point four four one. Point oh oh nine. Okay. Trees built. Let's use it to find some of these probabilities. Suppose a defective appliance is chosen at random. What's the probability that it came from company A? So what do I have to assume about this appliance first? What's been given to us for our initial condition? Okay, so given that it's defective, what's the probability that it came from? So putting that together as a conditional probability, what's the chance that it means servicing or is defective coming from company A? What's the chance that it needs, what's the chance that if I know it needs servicing, it came from company A? That would be out of all the dishwashers or service or all appliances that need servicing, what well, part of those were also from company A? Where am I going to get the proportion of appliances that need servicing? All the logical ones. That can bring. All the bottom ones, right? Because I could need servicing from any one of the three companies, right? Yeah. So I need to do 0 0.0015 plus 0 0.006 plus 0 0.009. And then only looking at these three values, because I have to know that it needs servicing, looking at only these three pieces on the tree, which part came from company A also? Mm -hmm. Out of all the different appliances that need servicing, what proportion came from also company A? So let's get this tallied up. 0 0.0015 divided by 0 0.0015 plus 0 0.006 plus 0 0.009. Looks like We'll do the same thing for company B. I'm going to have the same three tallies for appliances that need servicing. Oh, 
But then what part of that came from group B? Mm -hmm. Just the second number, that part right there. Those that needed servicing that also came from uh, company B, 0 0.006. Just pull that up here. Thirty six point three six percent, significantly higher, about four times as likely. Group B appliances had a higher service rate, a, a half a percent higher than in group, uh, group A. So if I know it's defective, it's more likely to have come from company B than in company A. Company C would be even higher still. They had a higher defective rate than company A or company B. Okay. 